All right, well, Jen, let's take a look at the weather outside. Fog, is it clearing a little bit now as the sun's coming up? Yeah, it is. It's starting to clear a bit, especially over northern Broward, northwest Broward. You're, you're starting to see a, a little better conditions out there as far as visibilities are improving. We'll get to that in a sec. Now, this photo is taken in sunrise by Javier Carretero, and you can notice there's still some fog, but uh, it's thinning out. It's burning off. Look at that blue sky above the fog. And then the sunrise photo this morning out of Lardo by the sea. Alex Kublikas uh, taking a beautiful shot of that sky, the ocean in the distance. So it was clear along the coast. No fog developed there. However, uh, at this moment, there's still fog draping over Miami-Dade, even southwest Broward. So Pembroke Pines, it is dense. Uh, the visibility down to half a mile improving somewhat in West Kendall and uh, not so much for Miami and Opelika. So the improvement is really for uh, the northern part of Broward and of course even out into sections of uh, western Fort Lauderdale because eastern Fort Lauderdale along the coast you didn't have fog this morning. So we'll be dealing with this uh, fog. It'll burn off eventually. It takes some time so dense fog advisory does remain in effect until 9 a.m. This is what it looks like right along the coast along the beach. Beautiful in Lauderdale by the sea and this is the Windjammer Resort camera. Notice that surf. <laughs> There's no surf because it is nice and smooth. Rip current risk today for beachgoers. It is low and it is a beach day because it's warming up close to 80 degrees right along the coast. And for boaters, beautiful conditions out on the water. The wind still light that the bays are nice and smooth seas about two feet or less than that. Temperatures right now running anywhere between the low to mid 60s from Broward uh, down through even the upper keys. And then it's the upper 60s in Marathon and Key West. Key West at 68 degrees. I want to show you that there is some wintry mix happening right now across sections of the Tennessee Valley moving into the Ohio Valley. Eventually it's going to also move out into the northeast rain down south. That system has a cool front, but it is not headed our way. What we're dealing with is still the remnants of a tail end of a cold front that did not move through South Florida, just remained over our area. It's going to lift as a warm front to the north of us. Tomorrow stays warm. Monday, even Tuesday, basically almost all week. By the way, tomorrow the breeze increases and so does the cloud cover. After a foggy morning today, mix of clouds and sun with a high of 80. Tonight, still the chance for some patchy fog, but I don't think it'll be as dense as it's been this weekend. And then the breeze picks up tomorrow gusts up to 20 miles per hour. Here's a look at that seven day forecast. So what we're looking ahead for 80s until Friday behind a cold front much cooler.